So I told you I was doing a product review today and I am doing it on Dream Clean Cleanser. So this stuff is the bomb.com. Um, I've been using it lately um, just because I'm s my face is still kind of recovering from some products that I think I was probably allergic to in hindsight. So um, this one has aloe and soap berry in it. So the aloe basically creates a shield on your face. It has so many healing properties. People drink aloe. Um, it literally heals your cells on the inside out. So this is just creating a shield for your face. Um, then the soap berry. Huh, it's amazing. So it's a fruit and it is it naturally combats bacteria and it's um, naturally foaming. So this stuff isn't like, they don't have to put any chemicals in it for it to foam up and really get your face clean. It does it on its own. So these products are 100% natural. They have organic ingredients in them. Um, also, the Dream Clean contains extract of white tea. So that's any tea is going to have... Um, What's the word I'm looking for here? Mom brain. Antioxidants. Antioxidants in it. And so that fights free radicals. If you don't know what free radicals is, it free radicals can um, kind of change the DNA within your cells and create kind of like a cancer type situation. So um, it helps with that. And then... Um, there's spirulina algae, so that has firming qualities. When I put this on after I'm done washing my face, so I want you guys to do this. When you get your samples and you wash your face with a Dream Clean, if that is what I send you, because depending on your face type, I kind of base my samples upon that. Um, but if, if you get the Dream Clean after you wash your face and you pat it dry, just sit there for a minute and then do this, because this is what I do, I swear. I, so I'm like this. And then I do this. <laughs> and that, you can feel the firming. I swear, it's just, it's phenomenal. Because you can feel your skin is so tight. And it, oh my gosh, it feels amazing. So, what do I do? So, I get this, um, put, it, to, it takes like one and a half squirts for me, but two squirts. And then you just rub your hands together and then you circle motion and then you go up. And if you know me, I talk a lot about dead skin cells grow down. So any of your products need to go up so you can really get through those dead skin cells and get to your, your live healthy cells underneath. So um, after that, then you're going to want to just wash it off with warm water and then pat dry. No rubbing, no rubbing. Um, this stuff really, it smells clean, um, natural, I guess is how I would explain it. It doesn't have, excuse me, it doesn't have like a bunch of perfume. It doesn't have perfumes in it at all. And I'm super sensitive to the perfumes that people put into stuff and the chemicals that my face just breaks out. It's terrible. So um, this is really good for um, aging skin to use or sunspots to use once a day and then you'll use quench cleanse the other time of the day um, and that's because the saponins I'm probably saying that wrong uh, but that's contained in the soap berry it inhibits mel mel sorry melanin production <laughs> so it happens when you have a medical brain you have too many words in there that you get mixed up so melanin production so um, melanin is whenever we are exposed to sun, it's kind of, it's what makes us darker. So, um, that's going to keep those sunspots from happening and, and making your skin really uneven. So, uh, once a day for sunspots or aging skin and then, um, twice a day if you have acne prone skin, any teenagers really do awesome with this. Other than that, let me know if you're interested in trying it. I would love to send you samples. Thanks.